Francis and this is Josh Edgel and we're here at Queen Anne's County High School because the PBIS team is going to be having a talent show and Josh is the person in charge of that. So you have your auditions finished? Yes, we finished our auditions just before spring break. Uh, students have been notified as to who's going to be in the performance. Tell us how a person would audition for the show. What do they need to have prepared to come in like for next year since the auditions are already done this year? Um, if a student wanted to participate, they'd need to get their act ready. They'd need to you know, pick out what they'd want to do. Practice it, rehearse it, uh, be prepared. I think one of the teachers has, uh, has put together a couple of trophies. And okay. there are some small prizes uh, for the first, second, and third place uh, winners. Well, thank you for organizing it this year, and hopefully it'll be a fun time. Tell us the date and cost, all that kind of thing. Thursday, April 30th, 6.30 p.m., $5. here with Miss Wilhelm in the Queen Anne's County High School, which she's the principal of, and we wanted to ask you about PBIS. Well, PBIS stands for Positive Behavior Interventions and Supports, and it's a program that's actually a countywide program that supports proactively the positive things that are happening in the school environment. We recognize student achievement, we recognize positive behavior, we promote character education, and we also have an anti-bullying program. And I actually have two of my co-chairmen of the PBIS team with me here today. So they can tell us some of the activities or things that you've sponsored throughout the year. Absolutely. They have some detailed information that they'd like to share with you and we've had a very special announcement happen just this past month about our school that they'd like to share with you as well. Amy and Connie are going to talk to us, so I'll start with Amy. Tell us what events and what activities PBIS team's done. Okay, our PBIS team implements an anti-bullying campaign um, and note that utilizes lessons throughout the um, school day. Um, in addition to that, we also have um, a mentoring program as well as positive accolades for staff and students. Now, I hear there's a special award that's happened this year, Connie. Could you tell us about that? Um, yes, actually, Queen Anne's County High School was named one of the ten schools of character for the state of Maryland this year. And actually, currently, we're under review for a possible National School of Character recognition. Tell us again, date and cost, all that kind of thing. Thursday, April 30th, 6.30 p.m., $5.